Hello friends, welcome to this lecture of information theory. In this lecture, I am going to discuss the concept of communication model. In a communication model, we basically study that what are the various stages involved in a system for communicating a message from source to destination. In this entire diagram, you can simply see that here is a source which has a which has a prime task to generate some symbol in the form of message. The message when enters to the second stage, there is a source encoder which has a prime task to convert the message in terms of bits, that is in the sequence of zeros or ones. And there are various techniques that we have to study in information theory under source encoding section which tells us how we can convert a message into a sequence of zeros and ones that is machine code. So the various techniques involved are Huffman encoding, Shannon Fano coding, arithmetic encoding, run length encoding and ZW or dictionary encoding. We are going to discuss about these techniques under the section source encoder encoding techniques. Then from this stage, the message is going to convert it into the source code word and it enters to the third stage. Under third stage, there is a channel encoder which has a task to add parity bit per redundancy bit. And what is the idea of introducing the parity bit is to is to detect the error in the source code word and there are various techniques that are used to do so and these are linear block code syndrome cyclic code crc hamming code so from this stage the source code word gets converted into channel code word which enters to the next stage where the modulation of the channel code word is done to convert it into signal and this signal passes through some channel there may be certain problems or in the form of the noise inside the channel which can oppose the smooth transmission of our message so there are various channels used here to overcome the problem of the noise so we are going to discuss that also in a successive lecture then from through the channel, the message enters to the demodulation stage where the signal is converted to the form that could be fast to the channel decoder. So the prime task of the channel decoder is to decode the received message into the into, uh, into the uh, decode into the decoded message that is going to be accepted by the destination decoder and the destination decoder has a task to decode the message into the source source message the message that which was earlier sent by the sender is going to be decoded into its original form at this stage so destination will receive the message in this manner so in the communication model the main thing that we have to study in the information theory are, is uh, basically include various techniques of source encoding that how we can convert a message into the bits and the second thing is various techniques involved to do the channel encoding where we can add redundancy bit to the source code word so this is all about from this lecture on communication model.